I just wanted to quickly ask you about, I was talking about veteran leadership, was asked some of the young guys, like your linemate Sunquist and guys like that. Uh, how important is that role to you, being the captain of this team, and to uh, motivate, you're one of the last guys to ever leave the ice, and to motivate these young guys? Uh, I mean, I love the game, I like, uh, I love the guys that we have in here, and it's fun to be around them, and if I can share anything that I've learned through my career with them, I, I try and do that all the time, so it's a good group in here, and they're all working hard, and Hopefully they can all get to the next level and stay there. And if I can do anything to help them, it's great. What are some of the things, like a guy like Sunquist came to the team late last season uh, from another country. Are there certain things for the younger players that you help to go out of your way to make them feel more comfortable on or off the ice? Right now I'm just trying to teach Sonny how to warm up. Um, <laughs> he's, uh, I mean, they're good kids. They're getting used to North America. I think uh, we have a good group in here. All the guys are trying to help... Uh, the guys that are new to the team and new to the area get settled, whether it's uh, moving in or getting comfortable in practice and stuff like that. But uh, the young guys that have come in have come in with open ears and are listening and taking everything in, so they've been working hard. Do you ever organize uh, dinner or uh, days out with the players, things like that? I see there's a like bowling trip, things like that. Are there any things that help make them comfortable like that? Like that? We try and do some off-ice activities where we get together and have a good time away from the rink. I think it brings everyone together. Um, so yeah, we're having fun, especially when things are going well on the ice. It's good to have some fun off the ice. Uh, now, the other thing I was asking for a veteran role, when you were on like a hot winning streak like you guys were on and you got back on another one and you haven't lost at home yet, um, do you think it's a, a key role for you guys, the veterans in this locker room, to keep everyone at a, a level head and not get too high or too low at any point, whether you're winning or losing throughout the season? I think so. I think as a whole, as a team, everyone's doing that. I mean, even the young guys have played for competitive leagues, competitive teams, uh, and know that it's just the start to the season. We want to keep progressing and getting better as the season goes on and everyone's going to have a part in that and uh, everyone's keeping each other in check, making sure we don't get too ahead of ourselves. Uh, the other thing I was asking, do you ever take it upon yourself to, if you see a guy struggling with something on the ice, do you like to work on their games at all? Do you at more or less wait till they come to you? Um, I don't know. I think everyone's got a different personality. Um, if there's anything I can I can do to help anyone, I will. Some guys will come ask me questions. Other guys are quiet. If I can approach them, great. Um, I think every guy has a different story, and everyone learns a little bit differently. So hopefully, I can do something to help most of the younger guys here. Uh, my final thing, basically, to wrap it up is: What does it mean to be the captain of this team for as long as you have played in a long career and uh, be able to play in this area as long as you have? Uh, it's fun. This area has been great to me. I think. Uh, you know, all the people in town make night real nice to my family and myself, and uh, I love playing here. It's uh, like a second home to me, so I'm having fun playing.